Here they are for the fourth race. Best of the rest. These are the two-year-old Ohio sired Colt Trotters. Number one is High Kevin, owned by Tish and Kevin Cross with Dave Hawk. Two Spy is owned by Bates and Polk, Al Jones. Three Strike Fast, owned by Keith and Donna Ross and Ray Paver. He drives. Four Whips Potential is owned by Mary Cruz with Jim Cruz. Five Mr. Whipple is owned by Jeff Richardson with Dick Richardson, Jr. Six Magnetic Sabre, owned by the White Creek Stables, Randy Tharps. Seven is Fred Pickle, owned by Albert Grass with Jeff Fout. Eight is J.R. owned by Snelling in the Seville Farm. Terry Holt in the nine horses out. Six minutes. And they're off. Hi, Kevin from the inside is first away. Magnetic Sabre on the far outside with Fred Pickle. Strike fast between horses racing in fourth. Spy at the rail is fifth. Length and back. Whips potential to the inside of JR. And Mr. Whipple is last as they sort themselves out and race around the far and turn the first time. And Dave Hawk has high Kevin on the lead. High Kevin a length and a quarter. Fred Pickle is driving up to challenge early in second. And now Magnetic Sabre is third and taken to the outside. Now off stride. Spy is now moving into third position. Three lengths for the back to Whips Potential. JR and Mr. Whipple, the opening quarter in 29 and 1. In front of the stands for the first time, Fred Pickle is off stride while challenging High Kevin for the lead. So now High Kevin has got an eight length command. Spy along the inside is moving into second. JR now into third. And Whips Potential is off stride. Then it's the pair of Mr. Whipple and Magnetic Sabra as they race around the turn on their way to the half mile pole. And High Kevin is well clear now. High Kevin on top by eight lengths. Spy along the inside is second, two back, JR is third, followed by Mr. Whipple in fourth, Magnetic Sabre is fifth, then it's Whips Potential on a dead run, three more to Fred Pickle and far back to strike fast, 59 and four for the half, they're down the back stretch, and I, Kevin, leads the way by five lengths. Spy tries to draw a closer second, it's three for the back to JR, who's being called on for more in third, another two more, and we come to Mr. Whipple in fourth. Fred Pickle trying to get out back into it from fifth, but still has about eight to make up, as they start to tighten down on the leader, they head for three quarters, I, Kevin's on top, but it's just a length. Spy is bearing down now on the outside second. Two back, JR is third. Fred Pickle shoots the gap at the rail in fourth. Then it's Mr. Whipple, three quarters and one, 32 flat, 32 and one on the third split as they roll to the head of the stretch. And Spy takes over the lead, opens up by two. JR on the outside. High Kevin has dropped anchor. Mr. Whipple on the far outside with Fred Pickle as they try through the final eighth mile. It's Spy leading the way by three lengths. Fred Pickle with late trot. JR is on the outside. Mr. Whipple to far outside. Spy is on top, and Spy and Al Jones will win it by three. JR and Fred Pickle third. Back to the winner's circle is number two, Spy. Third victory on the season. The Satir Al Bay Colt by Shimitar out of Instant Impact by Christus Crown and by Fred Bates of Mount Perry, Ohio. Pete Polk of Zanesville. Ed Ryder, the winning trainer. Al Jones, the winning driver in 202 and 4. In the winner's circle, happy to make the trophy presentation. OHHA Assistant General Manager, Dale Ford. Two eight exact of four hundred seventy one dollars and forty cents. One dollar try. One dollar try. Two eight seven six thousand six eighty eight fifty. Here's your rundown for the fourth race. High Kevin was sixth by the winners. Strike fast seventh. Whips potential eighth. Mr. Whipple fourth. Magnetic Sabra fifth. Fred Pickle third. JR second. Scotty Hill scratch. Top down six one seven eight four five three two scratch. Fifth race coming up in 15 minutes at 235.